Thanks to these four partners, The Beacon is the only homeless day resource center in the state, serving over 225 people daily, over 365 days a year. Michael, tell me what goes on within the walls here at The Beacon. We basically are having a, an open door policy, so anybody in need can come in to receive services or just get in and out of the elements. Uh, we offer something for breakfast every day, a hot lunch. Mm -hmm. We do offer laundry services, shower services. We have a computer lab and then partner agencies throughout the week to try to directly connect them to services that they might need to improve their situation. John, your passion really lies with all of the families and the kids that come through the doors of the Beacon, isn't that right? It does, because I am a person who has came from this background, so I enjoy reaching back to the community and giving the children the same opportunities that I had to overcome certain obstacles in life. One of the programs that I am particularly very pleased with is Play and Learn because they come in twice a week where our other programs only come in once a week or once a month. And I would like to see more programming like that. But also I would like to see volunteers come in with an educational background which can keep our kids continuing to learn throughout the year. Volunteers really are at the core of what we do every day at the Beacon. On any given day we have volunteers here running the showers, uh, providing laundry service, helping in the kitchen. Uh, supervising our computer lab, helping at the welcome desk as people come in through the door, um, and then helping in our family area. So there's everything from super duper tangible jobs to things that really give you an opportunity to learn a lot about our guests and a lot about the community. Hope, Hope shines here. here. From the Beacon, I'm Emmy Fink, and, and you're, you're buzzed, buzzed into, into Madison. Madison.